Hi, my name is Henry Segerman. This is Recast 2D6 by the Dice Lab. So there's a three-sided die, a D3, and there's a 12-sided die. Um, the shape of the three-sided die is our own design. I'll talk about that in a little bit. Uh, the shape of the D12 is the ordinary regular dodecahedron, but the numbering is uh, unusual. So there's a one, so far so good. There's a two and a three, but then there are two fours, two fives, opposite sides add up to 10 always. Uh, there's two sixes, a seven, an eight, and a nine. There's no 10, there's no 11, there's no 12. So what are you supposed to do? You're supposed to roll them together and add up the result. So, whoops, so I got a six and a one, so the, the answer I get is seven. Let's do it again. I get uh, four and one, so that gives me five. So the point of this is um, the distribution of the sums that you get when you add them together is exactly the same as the distribution that you get from two ordinary cubical dice. So for example, um, well, on two cubical dice, there's precisely one way to get two by adding one and one, and that's the same here, that you can get two by adding one and one. Um, there's only one way to get 12, uh, which you get by doing six and six, and here you would do that with 9 and 3, but say there are two different ways to get 11, so 11 comes up more often than 12, you can either do 6 and 5, or you can do 5 and 6, and those give you different answers. And on this one I can either do 9 and 2 to get 11, or I can do 8, where is 8? 8 and 3. So again, there's two ways to get um, uh, 11 on this and two ways to get 11 on this, and you can check all of the possibilities and there's exactly the same number. Here's another way to think about it. Um, 12 possibilities on the D12, three on the D3, uh, three. three times 12 is 36, so there are 36 possibilities, which is the same as the six times six possibilities from uh, the, the 2D6. Um, so these come in black and white. Now the, the D3 shape, so you also have these in red, green, and blue. Um, so uh, it's, well, we've designed it so that um, it's a little bit different from some of the other D3s that are out there. Um, it, it always lands on one of these sort of distorted hexagonal faces. If you sort of try and stand it up on one of the, um, the, the, the numbered faces, it will always fall down, and then you read the number just by which one is pointing upwards uh, on, the, on the two ends. So this is recast 2D6 and our version of the D3. Thanks for watching.